The Battle of Brunkeberg was fought on 10 October 1471 between the Swedish regent Stensjur the Elder and forces led by Danish King Christian I. Background In May 1471, Stensjur the Elder had been elected as Lord Protector of Sweden by the Riksmot in Arborgar, advocating Swedish secession from the Kalmar Union. Herr Sten, as he was known, had garnered large support. In particular his followers were to be found among the peasantry in Stockholm and in the Bergslagen mining region. The latter regions trading with German cities such as Lübeck often found themselves in conflict with Union's Danish foreign policy. In later times the battle was often recast for propaganda reasons as a national war of liberation against Danish oppressors. In reality, most combatants on both sides were Swedish and the roots of the conflict were primarily economic and political interests. In response to the election of Stier, Christian I sailed to Sweden with a military force, intending to unseat him as Lord Protector of Sweden. Mooring his ships off Skepsholmen in Stockholm, he set up camp on Brunkeberg Sazen, a ridge a short distance north of Stockholm. The battle. On Thursday, 10 October, Stensjur and Nils Bossomstjur lead their troops north to the area which is hot to get in Stockholm today, near Brunkeberg after which the battle was named. Stensjur's battle plan was to catch Christian's troops in of ice. Sten would attack from the west, Nils from the east, and Knut Posse would strike out from the city itself. In the ensuing battle, Christian was hit in the face by musket fire. Losing several teeth, he was forced to retire from battle. The decisive turn of battle in favor of Sturr's side occurred when Nil's troops broke out of the forest north of the ridge, as Bezer's troops attacked from the city. This cut off a contingent of Danish troops at the Clara Monastery north of the town. Christian retired with his troops towards the island of Kaplingen. However, Sten's troops destroyed the makeshift bridge Christian's troops had built, causing many to drown. The battle ended in a victory for Sten's duel. Aftermath Sturr's victory over Christian meant his power as regent of Sweden was secure and would remain so for the rest of his life. According to legend, Sturr had prayed to St. George before the battle. He later paid tribute to St. George by commissioning a statue of St. George and the dragon carved by the Lübeck sculptor Bernd Nottinger for the Storkirchen Church in Stockholm. As an obvious allegory of Sturr's battle against Christian, an altar dedicated to St. George was also built in the church.